Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to create this fresh looking makeup. So first, skincare tip is to put on sanitizer to your hands to avoid any possible bacteria transfer to your face. Secondly, and the most important actually, is to drink a lot of water because this is great for your skin. And now we proceed with the makeup. Here, I'm using my L'Oreal True Match Foundation which is my favorite one, spreading that all over my face and up to the neck area. And to properly blend everything, I'm using my Real Techniques Beauty Sponge and just distributing the product evenly. So just dab, 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 and remember to not be too harsh on your skin. And again, do not forget the neck area. Next thing, I'm using my trusted Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and putting that on my dark under eyes on both sides of course and then the forehead, nose bridge, and chin area. And also, do not forget the pimple. <laughs> and with the same RT sponge, I'm blending the concealer evenly and just dab 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 again just very softly under the eyes. Good night. And to highlight my face and give that glowing effect, I'm using this cream highlighter of this Maybelline Dual Stick and putting that on the areas where the light hits my face. Bam! Look at how gorgeous it is. Highlighting definitely matters if you want to achieve the fresh look that we're trying to do for today. So I'm blending the product using a flat top brush and doing the same on the opposite cheek. And to give the cheeks that hint of color, I'm using my Natasha Lip and Cheek Tint and blending it using the same flat up brush that we used earlier. And to set everything that we put on our face, I'm using my super favorite powder of all time, which is the For You To BB Powder with SPF 17 PA++. So this is perfect to use for every day because it lasts all day and just makes the skin look flawless. And as I always say, do not forget the neck area as it is also important. So next thing, I'm using a very nice yet affordable drugstore blush which is this Nichida in Passionate Red. And I'm using my brush to spread that on my cheek area. And to give the skin tone some warmth, I'm applying this Witch Pouch Bronzer on my jawline and underneath my cheeks as well as on the temples of my face and to avoid looking flat in picture i'm also contouring my nose just a little bit and then curling them lashes and applying generous coats of mascara afterwards so this can pop the eyes in an instant and make you look more awake and do not forget the lower lashes as well you can play and smile while doing so so almost done here, I'm just gonna apply the Natasha tint on my lips and again just dab 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 to blend everything. And last but not least, I'll be doing my eyebrows using this Eated House Drawing Eyebrow which you can see in almost all my videos because this is easy to apply even to my clients. So just basically lining my eyebrow shape and blending everything with this angled brow brush. Doing the same thing on the opposite brows just very carefully because you know Kila is life. And the last step is just brushing the brows and that's it for today's look guys. I hope you enjoyed watching this very quick and easy to do makeup. So if you want to see more, feel free to subscribe on my channel and like this video. I guess we just achieved a woke up like this look. And thank you so much guys for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye!